Up until a few months ago, all of my RC stuff, my planes and my helis and my quads or hexes, had all been powered by or um, flown with uh, Spectrum radios, a DX7, and then Spectrum receivers. But recently, I was lucky enough to get a hold of a Tyrannus. And you all know Tyrannus is uh, free sky, is all open source. So that meant none of my RXs, even my, uh, my orange ones, um, wouldn't bind with the free sky unless he went out and got a module for the back of it. So I did. I went and bought an orange RX to slap into the back. And I've read that um, once you do that, you can bind your Tyrannus with all your um, your Futabas and your JR um, receivers. So I'm going to do that today. Hopefully it'll help somebody through this mysterious process. So here's the leave Orange RX. Got a little nubby protector for the antenna. This is what's in the box. And it goes on there. Um, the instructions I read leave a lot to be desired. You kind of have to fill in the blanks and translate it, kind of. Um, easy enough to install. Let's pop out the blank and then snap in the new one. And then put on your antenna and you're good to go. The issue comes in binding and getting it to the right um, working mode and that's a process of pushing this RX button down a number of times, three times rapidly, and it will cycle through the three different the three different modes of operation. There's one one green LED, two green LEDs, and three green LEDs, and it's trial and error to get to find the one that matches your RX. Off. Okay, so you turn your radio on and then press this three times real fast. Okay, now I'm in mode one, which is, according to the directions, DSM-2. You press it again three times. I'm in two blinks. Now I'm in DSMX-22 MS, all right? Press it again. Now I'm in three flashes, so I'm in DSMX-11 MS. So that's how you go through the different modes to find one that will bind with your RX. I'm going to go back to square one now. There, no, nothing. Next thing I'm going to do is get out one of my uh, uh, RXs. I've got a 7010 on a wing over here, and I'll try and bind it to that. All right, I'm going to start off in uh, one mo in mode one. Where's my little, there it is over here. I'm going to start off in mode one and try and bind it to my AR7010. See what happens. Okay, let's go. Okay, there's mode one. Set this down. I've got my bind plug in. Then you turn off the radio. And then binding is just like you would do normally. You hold the bind button down on the orange RX and you turn on your radio and see what happens. All right, I'm powering up the uh, powering up the RX. Okay. Holding the bind button down. Make sure all my throttles are down. Holding the bind button down. Turning on the radio. I'm not getting there, so okay, and there we go. It just bound right up that fast. So mode one is good for me, uh, but that's how you do it. I hope this helps somebody. It was pretty anticlimactic, but uh, that was pretty easy, and it was just like that. Snap of the fingers, and it's bound. Good stuff.